Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will talk about growth and decay problem, which we will solve by using differential equation. Now, in many situations, the amount of rate of change of a substance is proportional to the amount of the substance. For example, we can think of population of pupil in, in a certain country, radioactive element, population of bacteria in a culture, etc. Now, let us formulate this problem as so let nt denote the amount of substance at time t. Then what will be rate of change? So rate of change will be dn dt. Now, it is given that this rate of change is directly proportional to the uh, amount of substance. So, we have dn dt is proportional to n. So, we have dn dt is equal to k times n. So, we denote this k as growth or decay constant. Okay, so now dn dt is equal to kn, so we have dn by n is equal to k dt. So it's a separable differential equation, so we can take integral both sides. So we have ln n is equal to kt plus c. Now let initially at t equal to 0. N is n naught. So that will give ln n naught is equal to c. So we have ln n is equal to kt plus ln n naught. So by simplifying, we get n is equal to n naught e power kt. So this is so n naught e power kt is the amount of substance at time t, where k is the growth or decay constant. Now, uh, look at an example. Okay, so the example is, uh, suppose so bacteria grow in a nu nutrient solution at a rate proportional to the amount present. Initially, there are 250 strands of the bacteria in the solution, which grows to 800 after 7, seven hours. So, we have to find an expression for the approximate number of strands in and the culture at time t, and the second problem is the time needed for the bacteria to grow 1600 strands. So, here also we have uh, suppose nt, nt denote the bacteria present at time t. So, by the condition, by the condition that uh, at a rate proportional to the amount present, dn dt must proportional to n. So we have dn dt is equal to kn. So as we uh, as we have seen before, so we have n is equal to n naught e power kt. For n naught is the initial uh, amount. So here n naught is given 250. So we have n is equal to 250 e power kt. Now we have to find k. Now it is given that n is equal to 800 when t is equal to 7 by this. So we have 800 is equal to 250 e power 7k. So e power 7k is equal to 800 by 250. So we have 7k is ln 800 by 250. So k is 1 by 7 ln 800 by 250. If we calculate this by a calculator, we get this will be 0 point approximately 166. So this is the first one. Now the second one is the time needed 
for bacteria to grow 1600 strands. Okay. So suppose T naught is the required time to grow 1600 strands. So we have N is equal to 1600, then T is equal to T naught. So we have 1600 is equal to 250 e power k t naught. So e power k t naught is 1600 by 250 and t naught is uh, sorry. So k t naught is ln. 1600 by 250 and T0 is ln 1600 by 250 by K. So, what is K? It is nothing but 0 0.166. And if we calculate this, we will get T0 will be approximately 12.20. So, after 12.2 hours, this uh, bacteria will grow, grow to 1600 strands.